Have you ever spent years studying a foreign language only to freeze up completely when it's time to actually speak it? Imagine if there was a way to bypass those mental blocks and learn any language as naturally as a child does, without the endless flashcards, grammar drills and frustrating translations. What if I told you that one of history's greatest scientific minds discovered a technique so powerful it could completely transform how your brain processes language, allowing you to absorb new words and phrases at speeds you never thought possible? Richard Feynman, the Nobel Prize winning physicist renowned for his ability to explain complex concepts simply, didn't just revolutionize quantum mechanics, he also cracked the code on how our brains most efficiently learn languages. And today, I'm going to reveal his ingenious three-step method that most language learning programs deliberately hide from you. Has this ever happened to you? You're trying to have a conversation in your target language, and suddenly your mind goes completely blank. You desperately search for words, mentally flipping between languages like shuffling through a disorganized deck of cards. That frustrating mental roadblock isn't your fault. It's the direct result of how we've all been taught to learn languages. But before we begin, please hit the like button and let me know where in the world you're watching from today. It's always fascinating seeing who's joining us from around the world. And if you haven't already, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of our future videos. Here's the breakthrough insight that changed everything for me. Traditional language learning creates a fundamental neural bottleneck. When you learn that perro means dog in Spanish, you're forced to create a mental translation circuit that always roots through your native language. Your brain constantly shuttles between two linguistic systems, creating a processing traffic jam that prevents true fluency. Think about how children master languages so effortlessly. They never memorize vocabulary lists or conjugation tables. When a child hears perro, they immediately picture a furry animal running, barking, and wagging its tail. They bind the word directly to reality, creating powerful neural pathways that completely bypass the translation process. Stay with me until the end, because what you're about to discover might completely transform your relationship with language learning forever. The secret lies in Feynman's genius visualization technique, binding foreign words directly to sensory experiences rather than their translations. When you hear machina in Italian, don't think car in English. Instead, visualize an actual vehicle. See its color and shape. Feel the texture of the steering wheel in your hands. Hear the engine purring. Smell the leather seats. By creating this rich, multi-sensory connection, you're engaging neural networks that are vastly more powerful than those used for rote memorization. What's fascinating is how this approach creates an entirely different learning experience. Rather than struggling to recall vocabulary from a mental filing cabinet, the words begin flowing naturally as they connect directly to your sensory experience of the world. But this is just the first part of Feynman's revolutionary approach. The second step amplifies these connections in ways that most language learners have never considered. Now, I want to go even deeper into this topic because there's a hidden truth about language learning that completely transformed my mindset. It's not just about creating these rich sensory connections. It's about activating an entirely different part of your brain through what I call the teaching revelation. If you're serious about mastering languages faster, hit that subscribe button and join our community of learners who are transforming their approach to language. Acquisition using these powerful techniques. You see, most people fall into the trap of passive consumption. They listen to language podcasts while driving, use apps for 10 minutes before bed, or flip through phrase books and they genuinely believe they're making progress. But here's the shocking reality. Your brain is incredibly efficient at creating an illusion of understanding. It convinces you that you've mastered something when you've barely scratched the surface. 
the real transformation happens when you try to explain what you've learned out loud. This simple act creates a profound cognitive shift that few language learners ever experience. When you attempt to teach a concept, even if it's just to yourself in the mirror, your brain suddenly has nowhere to hide. The gaps in your knowledge become immediately apparent, forcing your mind to reorganize scattered information into coherent patterns. This verbalization process is the missing link in most language journeys. By speaking out loud, you're not just reviewing information, you're actively reconstructing it, creating new neural pathways that strengthen with each repetition. This simple practice can multiply your retention by up to 27 times compared to passive reading or listening. That's not a small improvement. It's a complete paradigm shift in how your brain processes language. But there's another critical element to this approach that impacts everything. The quality of your concentration. Most people study languages with one eye on their phone, constantly interrupting their focus with notifications and distractions. They might study for hours, but make minimal progress because their attention is fragmented. The decision to structure your learning differently creates remarkable results. Instead of long, distracted sessions, break your study time into 30-minute blocks of complete immersion, followed by 10-minute breaks. During these concentrated blocks, eliminate every possible distraction and give your undivided attention to the language. This approach aligns with how your brain naturally processes and consolidates information. The intense focus activates deep learning pathways, while the strategic breaks allow your mind to cement what you've absorbed. One hour of this focus practice is worth several hours of distracted learning. It's like the difference between watering a plant with a focused stream versus sprinkling droplets that evaporate before reaching the roots. What's fascinating about this method is how it creates a virtuous cycle of accelerated learning. As your concentration muscle strengthens, your ability to visualize and connect words directly to experiences improves. As those connections strengthen, your ability to explain concepts becomes more fluid. Each element reinforces the others, creating an upward spiral of rapid improvement that most language learners never experience. The journey toward language fluency doesn't have to be the long, frustrating slog that most people endure. By applying these principles consistently, you'll notice a dramatic acceleration in your progress, often within the first week of practice. Write in the comments, I'm breaking the translation habit, if you're ready to transform how you approach language learning. But here's where we encounter a fundamental revelation about how our brains actually work. Despite what traditional education has taught us, your mind wasn't designed as a storage box for memorizing disconnected lists of words. Evolution crafted our brains to connect, visualize, and create meaning through sensory-rich experiences. This insight completely transforms the language learning journey from a tedious academic exercise into a vibrant, multi-dimensional adventure. When you come across the Spanish word manzana, the conventional approach tells you to memorize manzana den uh, apple and repeat it until it sticks. But this method fights against your brain's natural architecture. Instead, picture a vibrant red apple. Imagine its weight in your hand. Visualize biting into its crisp flesh and taste that perfect balance of sweetness and tartness. Feel the juice running down your chin. Smell its fresh aroma. By creating this multi-sensory experience, you're engaging neural networks that are vastly more powerful than those used for rote memorization. Each sense you involve creates additional pathways to retrieve that word, anchoring it deeply in your experiential memory. This is the same reason why you can instantly recall the smell of your childhood home or the taste of your favorite food. Sensory experiences create deep, lasting impressions that vocabulary lists simply cannot match. The beauty of this approach is how it aligns with your brain's inherent strengths rather than working against them.
it's not about forcing yourself to study harder. It's about studying smarter by leveraging the way your mind naturally processes and retains information. This represents a complete paradigm shift in language acquisition, bringing everything together, the practical implementation of what I call the Feynman method combines three powerful techniques into one cohesive system. First, structure your learning into short, intensely focused blocks of 30 minutes, followed by 10 minute breaks. During these sessions, eliminate all distractions and immerse yourself completely in the language as if nothing else exists. Second, always connect words directly to vivid images and sensations rather than translations. Create rich multi-sensory experiences for each new concept you encounter. And third, solidify your understanding by explaining what you've learned out loud, either to yourself or to someone else. This systematic approach creates a powerful feedback loop. The focused sessions maximize your ability to form strong neural connections. The visualization technique ensures those connections bypass translation and link directly to meaning. And the explanation process forces your brain to organize that information into coherent patterns that you can access fluently. The impact of implementing all three elements together is far greater than using any one technique alone. It's like the difference between trying to light a fire with a single match versus using a blowtorch. The integrated approach ignites learning at an entirely different level, potentially accelerating your language acquisition by up to 27 times. This method doesn't just help you learn faster. It fundamentally changes your relationship with the language. You begin to think in your target language rather than constantly translating, opening doorways to cultural nuances and expressions that were previously inaccessible. Write in the comments, visualization is my new superpower if you're excited to try this sensory rich approach to language learning. So there you have it, a complete reimagining of how to approach language learning inspired by one of the greatest minds of the 20th. Century. What makes this method so powerful is that it works regardless of your age, background, or previous experience with languages. It simply aligns with how your brain naturally processes information rather than fighting against it. If you found value in these insights today, I'd love to have you join our community of language learners and critical thinkers. Subscribe and you'll get access to weekly videos where I break down complex learning concepts into practical, actionable strategies. Just like this one. I'm genuinely curious which of these techniques resonated most with you. Drop a comment saying, my brain was made for this. If you made it all the way through and are excited to implement these methods in your own language journey. If this approach has shifted your perspective even slightly, that like button is a small way to let me know this content was helpful to you. It also helps others discover these ideas who might be struggling with the same language learning challenges. And if you're ready to take this even further, I've created a video right here that reveals the optimal daily schedule for language learning using these exact principles. Click and continue with me over there to discover how to structure your practice for maximum results with minimum time investment. I'll see you in the next one.